Well, horses once headed for slaughter transformed into prize winners by a disabled Burbank veteran who's found healing through horse rescue and is truly making a difference. Second chances are so well worth it. They can come out champions. Jimmy Darling at the Los Angeles Equestrian Center reflecting on her unlikely collection of prize ribbons. Each of these were won by horses rescued from something known as the kill pen, the last stop before being exported for slaughter. You got to turn four this month because we got you. Jimmy has dedicated her life to rescuing horses. And she is just as gentle as can be. Lexi, rescued in April, is one of about a dozen horses Jimmy is rehabilitating. Janet is another. Mommy loves you so much. As are Jethro. Good boy. And Ellie Mae. Want a treat? They're coming in very traumatized, much like a lot of veterans are, coming back to the real world traumatized. And it takes a moment to gain their trust. Jimmy is an Air Force veteran. I was an explosives and bomb expert. Who suffered a traumatic brain injury. She started rescuing horses to heal herself. From quarter horses, to mules, to many Palominos like Smurf here, Jimmy bonds with them all. Hi, Smurf. Are you my angel? You're my angel. I owe my very existence to the animals that owe their very existence to us. Just like Jimmy, every horse here has a story. Ellie Mays? She and her brother had pulled a plow until their backs couldn't do it anymore. And so they were sold for poundage, really, so that somebody could get money off of them. Now in her new life, she's become a blue ribbon winner. And Lexi is now a show horse. Every year, some 20,000 American horses are auctioned and exported for slaughter. The way Jimmy sees it. I can't save them all, but to this one, I made a difference. To that one, I made a difference. At least I can make a difference to the ones I grab, to the ones I can, I can take. Is she an angel or what? They're helping each other, don't you think? No question. I grew up around horses. I love them. They're just so gentle, well, kind. Well, our little granddaughter is yeah. an equestrian, so she would love to go and actually see those rescued animals yeah. and, and help to take care of them. So yeah. thank you, Jimmy. Yeah. And if you know someone making a difference in your community, we'd love to hear from you. You can reach out on kcalnews.com.